Hi, welcome back to the channel. Um, today's video is about fully serviced pitches. As we're staying on a gold pitcher here at Blakemere, I just thought it'd be the ideal time to show you how to set up what products you can buy for a fully serviced pitch. So I thought I'd start off by the post itself, your service post. I thought I'd use this one, which is the caravan next door to our pitch. It's actually been used by a seasonal pitch holder, but I thought it would be the ideal one to show you because everything's connected. Um, what you get on a fully service pitch is on one of these posts. Overnight these light up, so you get your own little light uh, uh, next to your pitch. You've got your own water tap, electric ECHU hookup, and on this post you've actually got a TV connection as well. On some fully serviced pitches you'll also even get a satellite connection as well. So that's the post itself. What else do you get on a fully serviced pitch? Well, at the, towards the rear of your pitch, you will get your own grid for your waist, so there's no need for a, for a waste master or anything like that, because your waist comes directly, your grey waist comes directly out of your caravan and straight into the ground, which is easier all round. So we'll head over to the back over to the caravan and I'll show you the two types of kits that you can buy for fully serviced pitches. So what equipment do you need for a fully serviced pitch? Well it depends really, it depends on really how much you want to spend. A really simple um, setup was for your grey waist, um, was a long um, five metre flexi hose uh, that had a splitter that just went from the, your front sink to your back sink and shower and it just went into one with a long flexi hose. I did a preview, I did a video, the link is in the description, so if you're interested in that cheaper option um, where you use your barrel and a ball cock set up. So basically you part fill your barrel, this raises like, like, on, a, like on a toilet system and then cuts off your water um, and obviously you have your, your hose. If you want to um, spend a bit more money, you can have one that goes from the tap and plugs directly into your whale fitting on the side of your caravan for your water, um, putting water into your caravan. Um, I'm not too sure what they retail at, but I know they're over £50, so, that, so they're not a cheap item, whereas I managed to pick up the barrel and the hose kit with the ball cock system. And it was less than 20, well, less than 30 pounds for the whole lot because I bought the barrel off a, off a selling site and this off eBay, that kit off eBay. But the wild direct feed from the tap into your caravan, a little bit more expensive. The other thing we bought was this kit here. Now this kit is for your waist, your grey waist for, for the front and back, and then it, it, it goes into into one pipe. And it's very simply put together. You make a U shape like that, you put the other elbow in, pushes in, you can position it, you can ex and you can also extend it if, if you so wish. If you wanted to, you could just have this going straight into your waste master. So this is an ideal piece of kit for both scenarios, whether you're on a service pitch or on just a normal basic pitch. We found this pretty damn good. It slots in really easy. It's easy to dismantle, it's easy to clean, so a pretty good piece of kit. I'll show you the full setup of this in a minute. So the other piece of kit we bought from Collapse also was the Flexi Waste Pipe Kit. That attaches to that, in, um, that kit there. So you get four of these, which also extend. So you've got a, you've got about four meters because four of these come in the pack. So you've got about four meters. So no matter how far you, you are from your waist grid, you're going to reach with these. Obviously, you can bend them and show you. I'll show you these set up in just a second as well. They all come in their own little carry bags, as you can see here. So everything's nice and easy to clean and it all fits in the nice little bags. So these pack away in your kit box really easily. 
So here we are at the side of the caravan. Your water inlet in the side there. In our, in our case, we're using the barrel and ball cock. Um, but if you wanted to spend the more money, you'd buy the whale one that plugs directly in the side. So what we are gonna do is use our normal pump Plug straight into the side. Drop your pump in your full barrel or your three quarter full barrel. Insert the ball cock in the side. I've done a full video on this, so I'll put a link in the description for this. So then, all you do is attach one end end of the hose to the ball cock and then one on the tap on the surface post. But as you can see, with us not having a long enough water hose, we're just having a full water button just using our normal pump. We don't have to walk far to fill it up anyway, so it doesn't really make any difference. Right, so set up your waist, your grey waist with the collapse system. You just make a U shape like that, stick the other elbow joint in to make an M shape, and those two furthest away, open up your waste pipe flaps. They are quite flexible, so you will need to have a little bit of a jiggle around. Push, push them in all the way. Now you can either use this with a waste master, but as we're on a service pitch, in our case we only need two of these, we came in four in the pack. Um, so I can either just give that a slight slope. Oh, wrong end. push them in like that. Now you can actually buy little pegs that give you a gentle slope down to your waist grid. We've never really had a problem so we've never really needed them but you could do this slightly different. You could lose that that one piece. I'm trying to think how I can do this now. Slot that straight in there and then use the next one to go straight into the grid which I'll show you now which then does actually give you a bit of a, a slope down so I'll just attach this second one and you'll see the grid what I'm talking about on a fully surface pitch so there you go there is the setup gentle slope down so it'll push all your grey waste out and then as you can see under there if I can position it right there's your grid and then all you do then is drop that down there and there you go and there's your grey waste so there you go, a little bit of an insight into fully serviced pitches. Um, I hope you found that helpful. If there's any questions, don't hesitate to pop a few in the comments there. Um, if you found it helpful, give us a thumbs up. And it's absolutely free. Please subscribe to the channel, help us grow. It's absolutely free, it costs you absolutely nothing at all. If you hit the little bell icon, you'll be notified of all our future uploads. So that just leads me to say, Thank you so much for watching and until next time, ta -ra.